Welcome to technical drawing. Today we'll solve this sum in orthographic. See this 84, 80 and height is 72. So we'll draw it front view, top view and left hand side view in third angle. So first we will start with side view. See this is radius 32. So you go up by 32. You draw horizontal line of 32. And from this point, you take this radius and you draw radius 32. After that, this is radius 12. So you take 12 from here, total would be 24. From here we can take radius 12 now After drawing that we can draw this line dark, then vertical line, see this is 72, so go up by 72, then this is 28, then you draw a vertical line, then this is 8. You go down by 8, again you take 16, now we'll draw this part, how much is this height, 32, so from here we'll go up by 32. You draw a horizontal line, then you mark 16. So you take 16, 16 from both the sides. So from here you draw radius 16. from here you draw horizontal line so we are and now if you see this line is going through and through so we'll have this dotted line going through and through now we'll draw front view this part so that we can project from side view, circle in one view, other views, rectangle, this is 56, so I will take 56, then I will go up by 32, that I can take from side view, we are doing third angle right now, so that's why left hand side view is on left, front view and side view is down, top view is up. This is how it will look in front view. This part. Now we'll draw this part. How much is this? 8. 24. Sorry, 28. So that we can mark. 
this is 28 and 40 also we can mark we can go down how much we have to go down we have to go down by 24 and you can join this then you draw a vertical line then this height is 12 so you project from here this will be dotted it will be only 40 so this is a dotted for circular portion now this part you go down by 8 then again you go inside by 8 and then you go down by 16 Now when you see from here, this is going through and through. So this also we need to show dotted line full down. Now we'll see top view. This part that is 28 by 28. So that I can project from front view as well as side view. This 40 that also we can project this is 28. So I can mark 28 or I can project from side view. Whatever you feel comfortable, you can do that. Now after that, this part. So it will appear as a rectangle. This part is here. You extend from here. Extend from here. See this rectangle 56 that we can project from front view and we'll get top view like this. This part is rectangle. Now we'll have a dotted line for this. In top view, this part, this much part will be dotted because you can't see this from top view. I can draw axis line. Always remember, wherever you have a circle, you should draw axis line. to show that it's a curved surface. After that you can do labeling and dimensioning. Thank you.